I decided that, uh, you know, I'm tired of having to go through the court system and if I would just obey, then I wouldn't have so many problems. I'm someone who checks up on the government and it's suspicious to me that you're so worried about the people putting cameras on you. What are you doing wrong? Listen, you keep interrupting. You need to stop. I do have official business. You it's told me you don't. it's filming you. So I decided that uh, I'm going to turn over a new leaf today, and I'm just going to obey. Had public. What the hell is wrong with you, son? Are you threatening me right now, sir? Yeah, I like that. Well, you can like it all you want, Gary. 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 I find my masters, the ones with the badges and the robes and all that stuff, and and uh, bow to them and give them my praise and thanks. Leave me alone. Stay away from me. Don't blind me. Don't touch me. Back away from me. Back away from me. You're in my personal space. You're in my personal space. What's your name? Hello. I don't want to hear your shit. What's your name? What's your name? What's your badge number? Now get the hell away from me. Why don't you back off? I'm not backing off for my safety. You're behind me. I don't know what's wrong with you. For your safety, you should probably be watching who's behind you right now. I checked him already. No, I'm talking about the other guys who are recording you from over there. Just go do your job, okay? Just don't go do your job. Come Nobody. Okay? Just don't go do your job. Come Nobody's gonna hurt you. Why are you trying to sneak up behind I'm not me? Sneak up. I don't like you behind me. I need you to stand right there. You can. Hey, what's going on? Hey, what's going on? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get right there. Okay. Yeah, I can legally and lawfully be right where I am. I like so you go screw you. yourself. I don't care what you like. I bet he doesn't like you trying to take money from him. Did he give you a ticket? That's me. Gave you a warning? Yeah, thanks, man. Yeah, hey, no problem. Uh, I don't think that's fear. I think it's just shock and amazement that somebody would refuse to bow. I can tell how smart. How you're acting like a jackass. You're not scared. You're just trying to control me, aren't you? You're not scared of nothing. You Smart. How's you doing today, sir? Yeah. Hey, thanks for keeping us safe and free. Well, thank you. Just, just obey. I it. All right, thanks, man. Yeah, we appreciate it. Thank you. We're yeah. trying to spread the message today. Just obey. Can I kiss your boots? No, I'm good. Are you sure? Can yeah. I kiss your boots? I just want to feel. I just want you to really feel my support. Okay. Good. Well, we love you guys. Thank you, masters. Thank you for our freedom. I don't care to tell you who I am. Just asking what you're doing. Are you threatening me right now, sir? I'm on a public walkway. Why don't you stop harassing me and get the hell out of here? What's your badge number? Three, four. Take a hike. Three, so Take a hike. Quit trying to threaten me and boss me around. Do I look like the kind of guy that's going to put up with your bull crap? I don't Do I look like the kind of guy forever. who's going to put up with your bull crap? You're not worried one bit about my safety. Take a hike. I've quit bossing me around and definitely quit threatening me. Weren't you told to leave? Where's your supervisor at? I've had enough of your harassment. Where's your supervisor? Go get him. Deputy. Call him out. Deputy Call him out. Deputy Call him out. Bad public servant. You don't obey very well, do you? I told you to get your supervisor. You do as you're told. Get your supervisor. Bad public servant. Hey, no, shut the hell up. I can walk along the side of the street all I want. Bad public servant. Bad public servant. What the hell is wrong with you, son? Do you understand who you work for? We hired you to serve us. Quit walking around threatening and intimidating people. Bad public servant. Weren't you told to leave? Where's your supervisor at? I'm the violence. Keeping us free and safe. We got a sign that says just obey to teach people that if they would just obey, the police should be free and safe. We thank you, thank you, as our masters for our freedom. Would you like me to ask before I lick, before I lick your boots or can I just lick your boots? Let him lick it, let him lick it. Come on, let him lick it. Come on, he's been wanting to lick some of the boots all day. Master, please. Come on, let him lick it. I'm teaching people to obey you. Let him lick the boots. I'm teaching people to obey you to preserve their freedoms. Let him lick. We'll turn the cameras off. Thank you for gracing me with your presence, Master. Hey, how are you hey, doing? Maybe he will, maybe he will. Thank you. Thank you for my freedom. Yeah. Can I lick your boots? <laughs> what are you thinking? What are you doing? What's that? What are you videoing in here? Everything I can see. Uh, who are you? I'm just irrelevant. Who are you? No, I need your ID. You need my ID? Yes, please, thank you.
Can I have your ID, please? Oh, I need your ID. Um, that would get you in a lot of trouble. So. Uh, I don't think so. I'm the chief. <clears throat> and if you're going to come into my lobby and videotape, in, in today's day and age, I think I have the right to ask you for to identify yourself. Okay, is it not a public lobby? It <clears throat> is. I need your ID. I'm asking if photography is a crime. I it's need a, your ID, It's sir. a yes or a no. I need your ID. Why, do you suspect me of a crime? In, in the state of we Utah... We have the right to identify it. You can ask, but in the state of Utah, you have to suspect me of a crime in That's order to... That's not true. So it's a stop and ID state, huh? Without even suspicion of a crime. I can tell you, I'm news media. I'm here filming. Well, that would be nice to know. And that that's would, all you need to know. That would you didn't helpful. ask. Sir, do you have uh, news media identification? Don't need it. Yeah, I'd like that. Well, you can like it all you want, Gary. Logan Police Department, Logan, Utah. Yeah. Mods, if you can do you have, help me out. Do you have media ID? I don't need it. Well, I'm asking you to identify yourself, sir. This is really odd that you're it's, walking around my lobby. In my lobby. Vi videotaping this lobby. My that's, lobby. That's suspicious to me. My lobby. And I'm curious to know who you are. I'm someone who checks up on the government, and it's suspicious to me that you're so worried about the people putting cameras on you. What are you doing wrong? I'm not doing anything. Then why are you so worried about the camera? Because I need to know who you are. You are doing something wrong right now. You're trying to demand ID unlawfully. Now, I can understand if you're suspicious, you can ask me what I'm doing. Hi, I'm here filming you to check up on you and make sure that you all are obeying the law and not violating people's rights. That'll be all. Am I detained or am I free to go? No, you're detained. I am detained? Yes. All right, so we're going to do an unlawful detainment then? I need your ID, sir. And what crime do you suspect me of? I need your ID. So you're demanding my ID, and yes, if I don't give yes, it to you, then what? I need your ID, sir. Well, I'd like to assert my rights, but if you're threatening to violently throw me in a cage or something, if I don't give it, then I'll give it under duress, under threat of violence. Okay. I'm going to ask you to, um, to leave. You can, you're asking me to leave a public lobby. As the media, yes, you're, you're going to violate the so First Amendment. So you haven't identified right? yourself as media. I don't, it, uh, yes, I did. Yeah. I just told you I was media. Leave. You're telling me to leave? Yes, sir. Or what? Will, or or will leave, you use sir. violence against me? Just leave. No, no, no. Look, I don't, I'm not here to cause you a problem, but, but you're, you're causing, causing a problem. problem. But you're causing a problem. I'm asking you to leave, sir. And w are you going to arrest me if I don't? I've asked you for your ID. You've denied that. Well, you have. I'm haven't... asking you to leave the lobby, sir. You realize this is my lobby, right? That's fine. I'm asking you to leave. Okay. Are you giving me a lawful order to leave, or are you just asking me to leave? It's, Stand by. We'll okay. Wait for okay. Uh, I have the right to be in here and film my public servants. I feel kind of threatened at this point. Yeah. You guys are, yeah, you're calling more people with guns out here for a guy with a camera. What gun? There's a gun right there. Sure does. There's a gun right there. There's extra magazines. How many times do you think you need to shoot me? I mean, that's a lot of magazines. Oh, it's just a camera. Bro, where are you coming from with the gun? Exactly. Where are you coming from? Let me just walk around and do my video. Leave me alone. Can we do that? I'd like to know what your purpose is. It doesn't matter what you'd like to know. And besides, I already told you, my purpose is news media gathering content for a story. And yet you don't have ID that would... I don't need it. Yeah, do you understand what freedom of the press is? Do you know who that's issues freedom. press passes? Who issues them? Okay. Nobody. The state doesn't issue press passes. So to get a press pass, what you do is you go, you can write it in crayon, or you can create it yourself um, on a computer. You can print it out. You can laminate it. You can make it look as professional as you want. But no state anywhere in the United States issues press passes because we have the freedom of the press in the United States of America. Mm -hmm. So anyone with a camera telling a story about a tyrant is press. Sure. Yeah. And so that's all I'm here to do. I was hoping, you know, I thought you told us. Well, then this. go ahead and take your, take your <clears throat> camera shot. Okay. Well, I'm just going to hang with you for a minute. Okay. Perfect. And, uh, Let's do that. Can we, can we give each other arm's length distance from each other? Well, for I mean, my safety and yours? Sure. Would that be fair? Yeah, that's fair. Okay. All right. Great. Okay. I was just about done in here anyways, but I'll right. go back so, through here. And, well, that hall yep. takes you down to the city office if you want to film there. Or <coughs> welcome to go out and take a look at the front of the building. It's a pretty building. It is. So. And what was your name? I'm sorry. You got me real nervous with you approaching me with the aggressiveness. Right and, no, there's nothing aggressive. Well, I, I feel intimidated and threatened. Well, I'm sorry about that. Yeah. Well, I don't think you are. That. But what was your name? Can you verbally give it to me? No, it's okay. You, you can't? You got my name right Is that what you tell the judge? Uh, I don't tell the judge that, no. No? Because you got a little bit more respect for the judge than, than the general public? I'm not going to engage you, sir. Well, you, you're not going to engage me? Good. Then go back to your office. Go back to work. Just and I'll do my job. You said you're not going to engage me, but you're going to follow me around? I'm just gonna that would be just stalking then. It's all good. That would just be stalking. It's and then I'd have to have the sheriff come out here and arrest you. Go ahead. He's on. What's that? 
Yeah, exactly. Well, what exactly. You guys are actually live on the internet right now. There's 1,100 people watching you. Okay. Watching you act up. Look at this. Oh, that is crooked, yeah. Can't have that, can we? Yeah. Must have had a drunk officer put that up, huh? Yeah, at least. You're dismissed. Thank you for coming. Great. Then um, I'll get back in contact with you, and we'll work on some procedures as far as not violating people's rights and intimidating people. If you want to do it, I like to take a proactive approach to things. I look forward to that. Okay. Do you really or no? Do you really? We can take a proactive approach to it and make sure that you aren't violating other people's rights. But if you're going to continue to do it, then we'll have to come back and keep teaching you. Okay, I'll take that as a no, we don't want to take a proactive approach. How you doing? Good. We're, we're uh, teaching people to just obey. We're going around thanking police for our freedom. Thank you so much for making us free and safe. You know, without you, we wouldn't be free, right? People need to recognize that. Be more obedient. Back the blue! This isn't a big deal, guys. I mean, they, they don't understand how to deal with people who assert their rights. They haven't had to do it before. They haven't had to do it before, okay? So I understand, they don't get it. They don't know what to do. But if we can just take a proactive approach and say, oh, you know what, dude, we screwed up. Let's do something so that this doesn't happen anymore in the future. Then we're all winning, every one of us. In today's day and age, I think I have the right to ask you for to identify yourself. All right. In this day and age, what the hell is wrong with you, son? I'm not your son. Oh no. What's wrong? Oh, it's your coffee again. Your coffee tastes terrible. Next time, give her a second chance.